Hey guys, Madison's Makeup here, coming at you today with my new tutorial called Makeup. Okay, so today, um, our first product is called M&M's. Um, I'm trying to get a sponsorship from M&M's, so M&M's, if you're watching... I love your product. It's my first product in today's tutorial. And, um, you know, M&M's, if you're watching, uh, can you please make this bag easier to open? I get it. It's hard to open, so I can't get diabetes as fast. But I can't do this. Hey guys, so, um, if you're still watching, M&M's are my favorite product. I got these on sale for a couple dollars. One dollar and fifty some cents at the local Walmart. M&M's, if you're watching, again, please sponsor me. I really like your product. My whole family loves your product. So today, our first product is called M&M's by M&M. Love the taste. Love the chocolate. So today, so our first product in this makeup tutorial, our next product after the M&M's is um, called Maddie. Plus poreless. You know, like the Maddie B, the wrapper. So, we're going to go ahead and put that on our face using this brush. It's called Eye on Beauty. It's called Eye on Beauty. Um, so, we're going to take it and just put some makeup on it. And we're going to put it on our face. You know, like a warrior. Like a football player. I think. And then we're going to put it on our forehead. And then we're going to put it on our chin. And then we put it on our nose. And then we put it on the side of our cheek. And this is called painting. Wait. Okay. So now we're going to blend it using this brush that's been chewed by the dog and we're just gonna rub it all in remember when spongebob said bring it around town bring it around town put it on your whole face make sure your brush is clean though or you might get diseases. I personally have hepatitis, but it's okay, cause I look good. Thanks, thanks to Madison's makeup tutorials. So we're just gonna put. We're also gonna put this. Put it on your eyelid. And I don't know why you'd ever want to blend that. I think it looks good. So, then you just bring it around town. And it's still on my eyes. Ugh! You just keep blending it. You just keep blending. Is it blended? It needs to, you put it on your neck apparently. So you just put it on, on your neck, on your chin, and you blend. And then, I forgot to do the most important part. I forgot to cover up my red face. You can do that using green face. Or, if you have yellow on your face, you can use 
purple face. Or if you have purple on your face, you can use yellow face. I'm a big fan of green face, because I'm a fan of the musical Wicked. Starring Adina Menzel. This is, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take this green, and you're going to want to take this brush. This one is from a craft store called Michael. This one's from Sephora. So you take it, and you're supposed to put it on before you do that, but it's okay. I forgot. And you cover up your red. And you just paint your face as if you were getting ready to go on stage at a performance of Wicked. And then you just slap it on there a little bit. And then you put your foundation on. You slap her on. And slap her on. Slap her on and slap her on. And then we have these cool things called blending. And you're blended. Looking great, guys. Next in our tutorial we're going to be using one of my favorite products both as a woman and a human my favorite product is primer this one goes on last but we're gonna go ahead and do it second and you just take it and you put it on your hand and you just rub it and you just rub it I got this one this one's called Elf. It's straight from the North Pole. Thanks, Santa Claus. And you can see that I'm already glowing. So next, con we're going to contour using this brush from Hobby Lobby. This brush is number five. And there's five brushes in the whole kit. This is the smallest one. So we're going to take, this is also e.l.f., this is from the North Pole also, but I got it in 2003, so it's a little rough looking, but Santa's so generous, he brought, he, he brought this to me. So you're going to just put some contour on your brush, and you're just going to draw squiggles on your nose, and some circles on your cheeks, under your eyes. And on your forehead, you're going to write the word dork. I know this just looks like a mean game that you play at slumber parties, but it's actually a contour method. So, now that you've got your circles and your squiggles and your writing, um, you're going to go on your chin and draw a W or a 3 also known as a butt. That's really going to make your double chin come out. You're really going to look cute. You guys are going to look so cute once you do my makeup tutorial. So, then you're going to use this brush, right? And you're just going to blend it in. So you're just going to blend it using my method called blending. And now, we're going to do our eyes. The eyes are the windows of the house. The eyes are the windows of the window. The eyes are the windows of the teeth. The eyes are the windows of the, of the eyes. The eyes are the eyes of the window. The windows are the eyes of the house. The teeth are the window. Our next product we're going to be using is this naked palette. It has black, brown, and pink. 
got my nose ring back in. Because if you put your nose ring in and you do your makeup, you'll get makeup on it. I just found that out. Anyway, so like I said, we're going to be moving on to the eyes. Today we're going to be using this e.l.f. brush, another brush from the North Pole itself. So, okay, so we're going to be using this naked palette, but we're going to be using, not, not this, it's called green. It's kind of a green color. And we're just going to go on our eyelids and just kind of go for it. And uh, you can see it looks green and it kind of looks like we're sick, but it's fine. So we're going to keep on with the green uh, on the other one. And as you can see, it looks really, really good. I really like it. So then the next color on our thing is blue. So you can see this one's kind of a blue. Here's, here's the hand trick. Here, you can see this one's blue. So we're just going to put the blue one on top of the green. Doesn't that look like a beautiful rainbow? So we're going to do the blue on the other eye. And it creates just kind of like a blue effect. I don't know if you can see that. Okay. So, next, our, the next eyeshadow we're going to put on is called Dark Dark Gray. It's from Naked 5. It's called Dark Gray. It's called Death. And we're just going to put that right on top. And now it looks like I'm dead. So we're going to keep on going with the gray. And um, it's really magical. I think it looks really good. Um, and then we're going to go on. We're just going to keep adding colors. Next is called Berry Purple. It's from the Fruit Palette. And it just looks like kind of a purple, like a grape, like grape soda. And that's just kind of got it, kind of going to go right, right where your eyebrow starts. And now you can see you've got full eyes. It looks really like cute and like colorful. And it's like, who's that girl? So next we're going to do our eyeliner. I like this one because it's just like taking a marker and drawing on yourself. So we're going to take this one. This one's also from ELF Elf. It's from Elf Collection from Elf Mart from CVS. And you're just going to put your Elf liner on on your eyes. And it's going to go all the way across. And then it's gonna, you're going to do the wings like so. You're just going to take the wings all the way out here. And yeah, so we're going to do that on the other eye now. I'm just going to take it out a little bit. And yeah, so now you've got wings. So, um, next, we're going to be doing, we're going to sh shave off our eye. Anyway, so, well, like I was saying, next we're going to shave our eyebrows off. So just take it and shave all the way across. So your entire eyebrow is gone, and then you can shave your legs with it later if you want. Okay, so once you've got your eyebrows shaved off, 
we're going to do a, a technique I like to call drawing new eyebrows. So this one, this is what I like to call elf. So once your eyebrows are gone, you might want to extend your eyeshadow up just a little bit. Um, I'm going to go back in with blue and purple and gray. Anyway, so this is our eyes now. Next, we're going to be, um, we're going to use this e.l.f. small brush with the end shoot off of it. We're going to take this small angled brush from Elfie's and we're going to put it in the brown and draw our eyebrows and as Bailey likes to say Bailey has her own little story about eyebrows what do you have to say about eyebrows Bailey? Bailey! Bailey what? what did you tell me about eyebrows last night? nothing you said something What'd you say about eyebrows relationship? Eyebrows are sisters, not twins. That's right, Buster. So they don't have to look the same. They don't even have to look similar. But they do have to be on your face. So, I really like these. They're kind of like a fashion like an attitude eyebrow it's like oh no you did next we're gonna be doing the highlight I like this one it's called elf and there's nothing left but I'm just gonna kind of rub it on my face and then I'm just gonna and that's the highlight and then um, last we're gonna use this bare minerals to kind of finish it off and um so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take we're gonna take it and we're just gonna put it on our face you know like a like a woman um putting her makeup on i don't know if you've ever seen that on tv but she'll put it on with a thing and she'll just just put some on And then, last but not least, the lipsticks. I like to use this one. It's called Red. By, it's from Elf's Christmas Collection. And when I put it on, I just go ham. Like, it just goes all over. Uh, I just kind of make sure it gets in every crevice. I just want to make sure it gets all over my lips. And that's my new look. This is... I got all of this stuff...